Hi beautiful beings, it's Yabby here and I have a new video for you guys today and in today's video we're going to be talking about how to stop eating bad like and what I mean by that is how to stop eating like bad food and junk food in general so I know that it's like when you go to the store or when you go out like there's like fast food restaurants or like grocery stores that make it so tempting to literally like not get like chips or I don't know, a burger or whatever it is. So this is for anybody. You can apply whether you're vegan or not. Like it's just on how to stop eating bad junk food because I like know that like throughout my life, even though I wasn't really unhealthy eater, like I would just just basically like every time I go out, I would usually go to like Taco Bell or like Chipotle or something. And I love those places, but there's like uh, I don't know, there's got to be like a limit to how much you eat, that kind of things. Well, okay, my first advice for you, I have about, I think I have about four tips for you guys total. So my first tip is to like not buy it. Like, so basically it's just don't buy it. So if you have like that bag of chips or that bag of uh, Doritos or whatever, which is a bag of chips, <laughs> I don't know, all I can think of is chips right now for some reason. Or that bag of whatever it is, like, or a burger that you bought and it's, like, in your fridge or something, then you're definitely going to eat it at some point or another because when you get hungry and you have, like, no food left, like, and that's the only thing you have there, you're not going to starve yourself. You're going to be like, okay, fine, I'll eat it just this one time. But if it's not in your fridge and somehow your house is, like, like empty and you need to, like, go eat something, you'll go out and, like, find a healthier alternative if it's not in your fridge or if it's not in your cabinet. So that is like the one biggest thing diff thing that I advise that I have for you guys is to basically just not buy like unhealthy junk food. Like unless you're like making a recipe or like it's a like special time or whatever, even then just do it in moderation because it's not healthy for you. Like it's not good for you. So just, yeah, if you don't buy it, you're not like going to eat it because it's not there. So just don't buy it. My second advice or my second tip is to replace those unhealthy things like that you love or that you crave or whatever with healthier alternatives. Say like if you love like eating like really, really like oily fries, like the bag ones that you get in the frozen section of grocery stores, like you can replace those with like the sweet potato ones which still have a lot of oil but that's a bit healthier and even better you can make fries at home like you can literally just chop up potatoes for like less than five minutes probably and then just like put some seasoning maybe some salt or something and put it in the oven and it's literally so much healthier and it would just taste just as good like literally i'm actually craving some of that right now but basically yeah you can always make healthier alternatives of things that you like love that are like really not healthy so yeah just make healthier alternatives or buy healthier alternatives and eventually get to making them and my third tip and advice for you guys is like basically is if you actually really have to buy these junk foods like say you're on a road trip or you're like i don't know going to like a meeting somewhere and you really need to eat something and like the only options around you are like really unhealthy places like junk food places or whatever and or grocery stores that you really want to get like a bag of chips or whatever then just my tip here is to read the nutritional labels and read the ingredients because you can always just like go for like something like of, I don't know like a can of nuts or something and just like snack on that for a little bit and that will be a lot healthier for you than like say getting I don't know like yeah let's just go with the chips example because I can't think of anything else so then getting like chips like a bag of chips which has like a ton of oil and also what I suggest is like what you should look for is sodium and salt like amounts on the percentage on the nutritional label so and for a lot of foods like you should look out for things like uh what is it that thing that that's in a lot of foods i forgot what it's called hmm. oh right i remember what it's called you guys i don't know why it just like i it just left my mind it was just there like but basically i'm talking about high fructose like high fructose is literally like 
so horrible for you it's so bad but like it's literally in almost everything and so is sugar and so is salt and basically just read your labels and read your ingredients to make sure that whatever drink or food that you you're getting from the store has as little of these as possible because these are not health foods and they're not healthy things for you to be consuming in a high amount so yeah and then my fourth tip for you guys is to basically like if you can't pronounce it don't buy it like whatever it is like whether it's like uh, like it's this applies mostly for grocery store items but like if you don't if you can't pronounce the ingredients on there like it says sodium something la something or fate or whatever it is like if you can't pronounce it or it's sansom gum or if you don't know what it is don't get it like i see randomly sansom gum just popped out in my head i have no idea what it is but it sounds like something weird so like it sounds like chem like chemically so if that's even a word so basically if you uh don't know what it is or if you can't pronounce it then don't buy it it should just be like a list of easy ingredients that you can pronounce and that you can understand in any like packaged items so that those are my four tips and like advice that i have for you guys to like eat healthier and not eat like bad and eat good yeah <laughs> so okay don't forget to like this video if you did comment down below letting me know like what your favorite junk foods are or what your favorite health foods are and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and live in love fully i love you guys bye <laughs>